Hello, my name is Rafael Fonseca. I'm a hematologist at Mayo Clinic, Arizona. I am a clinician, but I also participate in research, clinical research and translational research. I'm here today to talk to you about clinical trials. I am a firm believer that the best care of patients with cancer is at the center or in the context of clinical trials. It is through clinical trials that we have options that are not available otherwise for patients with this diagnosis. Clinical trials for cancer uh, can be of different types. Sometimes we have what we call phase one clinical trials. These are trials where we're testing at the very early phases a compound uh, that may be active against the cancer. There are phase two clinical trials where this specific compound may be tested against a specific form of cancer where we're trying to gauge the anti-cancer properties of the compound. And then we also have phase three clinical trials. And that is uh, when we test what we call the standard of care versus a new intervention or a new treatment strategy. Uh, the participation in clinical trials is always voluntary. I always tell patients that we like them and we'll treat them equally well whether they participate or not in this clinical research, but I feel an obligation to explain to them what options they have, including this clinical trials. As I mentioned, I'm a hematologist. I work with a blood disorder called multiple myeloma. This is a cancer of the bone marrow that arises from the uh, cancer or the malignant transformation of cells inside the marrow. We call this plasma cells. And we have seen an explosive growth in the number of compounds and drugs available for the treatment of this disease, primarily because of the process of clinical trials. Over the past uh, 10 years, we've seen four new drugs approved by the FDA, and I think soon uh, more will follow. And uh, oftentimes, we have access to some uh, compounds and drugs that we already know work against the condition, uh, yet they're not commercially available, and we can only provide them in the context of this clinical trials. So uh, truly, we are committed. We're grateful for patients' participation in clinical trials and believe that together this will lead to better treatments into the future.